Uh, hey Bree. I'm pretty bad at this. Just saw you today. I don't know if you noticed, but got a nice uh, summer glow. Now, show my nose there. Also, there's a sunburn in my world because I know. Damn, I applied to 17 jobs today. You know, I was gonna do this on my actual camera. I keep meaning to make one for you on my real camera that wouldn't be all blurry and crazy and stuff. But, um, it's not at this house for a month. So, um, anyway, I'm painting my room here, hopefully. You can see the beautiful beige brown combo. I don't think you can tell in this high quality webcam video, but they actually just painted over space wallpaper. Um, which is cool. I like space, but brown space? So I got some colors. I'm just to see what they actually are. And I realized that I have, like, this problem where if I don't like the name of a color, I refuse to paint my room that color. Like, I really like this shade up here, but it's called, like, I don't know if you can read it, it's like Dinner Mint. I don't want my room to look like a mint. I'm just gonna know, like, even if I like the shade, I'm just gonna walk in my room and know that it's called Dinner Mint. And already I'm smelling the smell of mint, and that's just not what I want for my room. I'm not asking you for help. I've seen how you paint. <laughs> but I wanted to read this poem to you because it made me think of you. It's definitely about getting outside of yourself and exploring, and that's definitely, definitely what you're doing. It's called Risk by Anaya Smin. I don't know how to say her name. I'm sorry. I should know. I'm an English student. And then the day came when the risk to remain tight in a bud was more painful than the risk it took to blossom.